Oh, there's a little cliffside walkway. Whoa, where does this go? What's that over there? Hold on, before I go down here, I want to check up here. I love the soundtrack and the sound work, creaking and groaning of it. Oh! Well, who's off uh, to start with y'all? Uh, I guess it's a wall it was. Where did that go? Kalorin. Stu Kalorak. It's Tarakai. No wonder what would have happened if I got all the pictures. I, I wasn't expecting that to be a slam cut. Uh, Ooh, starting to see some signs. Getting close to the border. Hitting that cluster of restaurants. I think it's getting darker as I drive. I think it cut just as soon as the song ended. Oh. More more shipping crates. Is this the end of that walkway that I was taking? I guess we're cutting back and forth. Ah, so I still have a chance to get more pictures. Good. Yeah, somebody really liked their shipping crates. Old train tracks. Kinda wanna see what's on the other side here. Oh, it's going too fast, I can't cross.
Security camera? What's that doing out here? I thought I heard a train for a second. For just a split second, I swear I heard a train. It was odd. one's all bent. Oh, the camera's following me. So I can cross here. I think it's some of the music's sounds that sounds sort of like a train. I wonder if that's on purpose. Ooh. Ah! Danger, unauthorized personnel, keep out. What is... What is that? It looks humanoid. Why does my camera mess up when I look at it? Oh god. What is that on the wall? Oh, fuck! Yeah. It looked kind of like the things we saw in that diner. Yeah, so the turn, the turn and call to take a fall, and uh, I, I'm both leading your and uh, our call and uh, puts all in time. Yeah, too. Uh, and it's real. Let me go. Let me go. Oh, she won. This one for you. Oh, no, no. Huh. 
case isn't here anymore. Where's the case? I mean, the case that was here the whole time, was that my camera case? Or the VHS tape case? Who's that thing? So I'm thinking before when we were taking pictures and we pulled over at the side of the road, maybe that was before the tapes thing. Maybe that's how we got uh, caught up in the whole tapes thing. Maybe we were just taking pictures. Just sightseeing at the time. Is this the same store? Oh, fuck me. There's my friend. It looks like they're huffing and puffing, like their chest is going up and down dramatically. It's unnerving. Hmm. I guess they joined me after I found them. You feeling up on four? Yeah. Who are you traveling with? I'm on my own. Sure. Right. You're not from around here. No. So, where are you from? Wherever I can find work. Yeah, not much of that to find around here. Only stop here for gas and directions. Well, before you go, you really ought to check out some of our many local attractions. What local attractions? Would you be interested in a giant ball of twine? Uh, sure? I've been known to enjoy a giant ball of twine or two in my time. Well, it's not the world's largest ball of twine or anything, but they thought it was for a long time. Until they found out it wasn't. Plus, no one's sure how it got here. It just showed up one day. It just showed up? Yeah, this was about ten years ago. Big ball of twine showed up in the park downtown in that big gazebo. Probably a prank or something. Like I said, though, it wasn't just a big ball of twine. 
What else you got? Well, there's the milk store, the state park, the ghost carnival, and the museum. A ghost carnival? <laughs> yeah, we used to have this old carnival that would travel the state every summer. Then winter, just outside of town. Anyways, the lady who owned it got sick, so she had them set it up on her farm. Then she died and everyone just kind of moved on. The kids say it's haunted. What about the, the milk store? Yeah, uh, it's a store, but they only sell milk, milk products, and milk accessories. Milk accessories? Yeah, like milk bottles and milking pails and such. Okay. Now, that isn't all we got. Uh, what's there to do at the state park? Hunting and fishing, I guess. Or camping, too. Uh, drugs, maybe, if you're into that. What about the museum? Oh yeah, it's real neat. I don't know if you remember the electrical company, but there's lots of stuff people find in the woods sometimes. They bring it back and they put it in the museum. It does weird stuff sometimes. Wait. I don't know if you remember the electrical company? What are you talking about? What electrical company? But as far as weird stuff people find in the woods, well, I think I found some of that. What kind of weird stuff? Just weird stuff. You should check it out yourself. Oh, maybe this is the precursor to that. And then I checked it out and found them. But then again, if that is the case, why are they there? I don't know. Uh, time for me to get going. Yeah, it looks like your friend has finished filling up. Uh... Thanks. Need anything else? You guys get much business these days? Being off the highway helps. When the electrical company shut down, that didn't help us none. Wasn't there some kind of accident? Yep. Must have been, what, 14 years ago now? But nobody really knows for sure. Nope. Okay. So... Now that the electrical company shut down, um, how do you get your power? I uh, better be going. You do drive safe now. Whoa. We're back here. Busted behind the diner. You must be the manager? Yeah, you're not gonna try anything if I like look the other way, are you? No, we're good. Alright. Whoa, all of these cases. All these VHS tapes. The symbol. This is the symbol I saw, next to the alien thing in the woods. So this is where I was getting the job, is this where they, I don't know, make the tapes or something? So this is me, uh, trying to fight against the demon slash alien slash whatever trying to make me do things. I think I need to shoot them. Ooh. Christ. Yep, I think I did have to do that. Oh god, which one do I watch? I'm pretty sure watching one of these is going to kill me. Is there a special one? Ah, let's go with this one. No. What? The hell?
Hmm. Hmm. I wish I could get out of this chair. Be seeing you, friendo. <laughs> friendo. I guess I'm coming back here to get my revenge. What, am I gonna shoot one of those alien things? Whoa. Yeah, there's no way this is gonna end well. Well, that thing isn't here. There's the symbol. Whoa. Jabert just flew out. What the hell is that? Ooh. Tentacly flesh thing. Wait. My. My camera? Or are these two different people? I think these are multiple people. Well, let me uh, make a map of my web mail phone. Let me make a web mail phone. Girl, did you hear me? Now, you can help That's good. Uh, get your name. I'm going to have my web mail well, what was your name? Now? 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 Yeah, so I just opened up the store page for Paratopic to read the description, and uh, the description actually tells me some things that I didn't even get from actually playing the game. Um, it says, as an assassin prepares for her kill, that'd be the person with the gun, I guess. A man is strong-armed into smuggling contraband of VHS tapes over the border. That'd be, well, the person with the tapes. And a young girl finds the rusted remnants of illicit industry deep in the dark forest. So the person with the gun is apparently an assassin. And then there's the man with the VHS tapes. And then the person with the camera is a young girl. And I guess, since they still had the gun at the end, and whoever called that, that in, finding the body, said that they found the, the body of a young girl, so I guess the assassin called in the young photographer girl? Called in finding her body? I found the question of who I was playing super confusing and weird. I, I thought maybe I was being one or two people, and that I was just maybe going forwards or backwards in time, but apparently I was just playing multiple characters and didn't even really realize it. How strange. I wish it did a better job communicating which which player I was playing. I don't know if it was intentionally made confusing, if they wanted that to be kind of ambiguous and strange, because it wasn't super obvious to me when I was switching characters. I mean, the, the case that the camera was in was the same sort of case the VHS tapes were in, right? So that's why I thought maybe when I was driving the car and that case was on the, uh, the passenger side seat, I thought maybe that was the VHS tapes and we're smuggling them across. That must have been on purpose, right? To give them the same case, that must have been on purpose. I don't know, I just come away from that feeling very confused. Um, but yeah, uh, story aside, I really liked the aesthetic. I thought the visuals were beautiful, especially the outdoor scenes. You could really walk around and explore in nature. And the sound work was really good too. The voices were so eerily similar to actual, understandable language that it kind of like fooled the ear if I wasn't listening too closely, which is just a bit creepy, really. 
weird garblings, almost human sounding, but not quite. I wonder how they did the dialogue. Well, that has been Paratopic. I hope you enjoyed, and thanks for watching.